program. Josh in Virginia Beach has been hanging on forever, <laughs> and I believe he called in before the show. So first in, first up, right here at 844-204-RICH on the Rich Eisen Show. What's up, Josh? Hey, I'm doing good. How are you? What's up? You, what's on your mind? Uh, what's on my mind? Uh, the With this whole coronavirus thing that's uh, sweeping the nation and delaying, like, uh, activities for the NFL during this offseason with OTAs and the NBA being paused. What's the difference between what's going on right now with COVID-19 and compared to what happened in 2011 when both the NBA and the NFL was under lockdown situation and the NBA played essentially 66 games and they went straight into the postseason? Why not just go right into the postseason with the NBA if they should pick up the season as oh, is right if, now, if they should, okay, if they pick should pick up the season as is right now, I, I I don't know. They may they may be forced to do that depending on when they're uh, able to uh, open their doors because uh, the the virus has uh, either been um, I, I wouldn't say licked because we're so far away from it from a vaccine that antivirals are are available and that we know we just have to. Thank you for the call. We here's the deal. For, for 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 places to be open, business wise and certainly sports, we have to know who's had it, and we have to know who has it. Like an app that would actually tell you somebody anonymously has gotten it in your area, or you you know somebody that you can be contact traced based on the pings on your phone. It's kind of crazy, but. There are ways to know, like I, I downloaded an app yesterday that uh, is connected to uh, the healthcare system in Massachusetts, where I check in every day saying, I feel okay. I click this button. Over 2 million people have now done that. We need to know, like this is the yeah. sort of stuff that we need to know who has it and who, has who it. needs to stay home yep. and who's had it. And if we know who's had it, we'll actually prevent that person from getting it again and their antibodies could be used to get people who have it better then we're not opening the economy period like that's got to get going testing and got to get ramped up all sorts of stuff now that said let's just wave a wand and say the nba can come back if it's too late then you got to go straight in the playoffs and say sorry to everybody ranked what nine through 15 thanks for playing yeah one through eight, you're in. In the same way the yeah. Ivy League basically said, we're blowing off our tournament. We're canceling our tournament. So sorry, teams seeded two through four, only the four top seeds, four top teams make it in the Ivy League to their conference tournament. Number one's going in. NBA might have to do that. I'd sign for it right now. Right now, I'm seeing how uh, players could go one-on-one -on, -one on horse through, what, Zoom or something? And yeah. yeah, they're talking about You wouldn't about want Zoom. to see LeBron versus... Anthony, look, I'd rather, watch, I'd rather watch the playoffs. But, no, I, yeah. but sh short of anything like that, wouldn't you want to see an NBA horse tournament? I mean, By the way, they're showing the 2K tournament they're having over the weekend. I was watching some of that. TJ Jefferson, Rich Eisen Show social media grand maester, asked a great question while we we're getting ready, disinfecting our workspaces for our show. Kawhi's been nowhere. He's on no TikToks. He's, no, he's not on Instagram Live. I mean, you know, Boardman has <laughs> been has shut it down. He went to the island. He's right. sitting on so, an island. I mean, Perfect. Wouldn't it be great to do. see Kawhi versus LeBron in some sort of horse contest? And then, like, like a tournament. Like, let's go one through 16. Let's get well, one through 32. Like, four brackets of 32. Let's get 100-some-odd players and go for it. I'd sign for it. I'd see it. I'd love it. That'd be great. You know, let's knock on wood that we can get there. Let's hope so.